in the dress as you can see watch see the heart okay and look at the heart that's in the chest right here okay watch this now look at the lovebirds see how he hides his work in her hands that's a beak and you've got a lovebird that's sitting up on top okay we're talking about lovebirds right hot wire It just gets better and better and better. Okay, now ladies and gentlemen, the painting on the right is so happens to be the diary of Leonardo da Vinci. He didn't just do still paintings. He made this painting move and he painted every little micro in there of the days he <laughs> lived. Now, as you can see, it has a lot, a lot of characteristics. Here's the heart in the dress as you can see. Watch. See the heart? Okay. And look at the heart that's in the chest right here. Okay. Watch this. Now look at the lovebirds. See how he hides his work in her hands? That's a beak. And you got a lovebird that's sitting up on top. Okay, we're talking about lovebirds now, right? But that's not why you're here. Uh-uh. It's over the hands, because the hands don't lie. Speak to the hand, and I'm going to show you. This is her hand. Now, what happens when you end up with a image that uh, you see of a masterpiece? And you see a hand like this, you go, <laughs> he, he can't do, he's, he's, not a, he's not a great artist, no way. Well, Leo is a great artist. He wanted this painting to pass these artists. He's laughing all the way to the bank, okay, because that's what he is. Remember, number one rule, can't do hands you're not good well he deliberately did that because it actually comes out to be the icon also for the skull in many different ways but let me put these two off to the side and give you the grand prize grand prize you see this is the hand of the mona lisa and what it has as you can see is the fingers that run on down and then this is the hand that's behind it that i have preset that so happens to be of the median. Now watch the thumb match a hundred percent in the fingers and then you can follow the stars in the circumference of the bent finger. BAM! See that? BAM! Huh? There you go. That's him. Now watch you can see you can see how this curves and goes. Watch. See how it goes like this and curves? He, he gives you these hidden because she's moving her pinky. And I made a YouTube of she's got her little, uh, uh, got him wrapped around her little pinky. Okay, and it's true. Look at that. Unbelievable. This guy is magnificent. Isn't that something? <laughs> it doesn't show up in vice versa too well. See? It doesn't because, you know, the darker and whatnot, but it's very, very, very cool. So listen, there's other images that I have that's nearly a thousand YouTubes. I thought it was a thousand, but I guess I'm being standard to be corrected by um, a little notification once in a while. But as you can see, here's the stars and it runs on down. Here's the pinky, runs up. Boom, goes right back, boom, and you got it right over here, watch. See? He follows, he follows the curve and everything of her finger. Now if you also 
<laughs> if you also turn around and, and, and do some research to find out if I'm lying and I don't lie for one red penny, you'll find out that they wanted to know how come his hands or the Mona Lisa's hands overlapped with other fingers and he erased them. He didn't erase them. They're extra fingers that he overlaid and he built them from many different layers. So, I mean, look at this. This is the way he is. He's a joker. See this? This is a guy and a guy above the bird. And when you go, they turn into cartoons. See? This guy is playing around with me and you and hiding his works for over 565 years. And what I got to say is, this is a magnificent hidden piece of art. It is a, it's a blessing from God. And I'm going to use my money for good causes. And when this comes about one way or another, either by the support of YouTube helping me, and, and, and I can see if I can help others, depending upon what happens with your subscriptions. Hit the subscribe button, notification, thumbs up, social distance, wear a mask, wash your hands, say your prayers, and with that, hit the YouTube kids notification to protect our kids out there. Let them grow up not to have this evil type stuff that may be out there to where it is not appropriate. And with that, may God bless the whole world, the whole universe, and the whole heavens, and you have a safe, safe life. Amen. this mountain with you guys to let you know what we got here and what we got is a Leonardo da Vinci painting this particular painting again is a diary a hundred percent diary of his entire life is in this and then on top of that in honor after he passed it was signed in code by Michelangelo and all his associates and friends and pupils that were of his um, teachings and of his lovers. And it's hidden in here. Now all rest in peace, 67, uh, 15 April of 19, uh, I mean uh, 1452 and for 1519, May 2nd, you know, I got all these numbers that go through like a slot machine war game of of all this stuff that he throws at me. It's hard to concentrate sometimes, but I'm going to show you this is the Birdman. Okay, can you see it? Can you see his arm hanging out and he has this owl and he has another bird and he uses his arm as a branch. And he gives this pointy hen, him and hat, and that's a diva dressed up man in his uh, sexual way. And this is also, if you take a look, a big S. It gets an S and an S, and it goes on and on. You can see you can see the swirls of the S's, and that's spelling out Sali. Okay, S-A-L-A-I. That's in one of my YouTubes also. Now, I, I wish you guys subscribe, okay? Because it really would help a lot uh, for learning and support. But let me show you what happens. This is an x-ray that is in the Mona Lisa that's been pulled. And it is the same over here, the same face. Now I'm gonna pull it over just a moment for you to see, and then we're gonna get right to the point, I promise. This big face with the nose is the same as this big nose and eye. Again, it is in one of my YouTubes. But here we go. Now, if you see the surrounding area, it's not gonna match identical, but if you watch, it's going to match to where you understand where he's placing it. And so when you put this on up and you play with this white symbol here, 
this this one here to get it close it fits everywhere but when you get it here you can see how he's rolling the same face okay he's he's got the same roll right here with the nose okay and he fills the eye but it gets better because this is mine this is the Mona Lisa out of it and I'm going to show you how that is the same as this and this is the same as that as well as this Mona Lisa is the same as this so to make this and the prior to be the same all I have to do is match this over the top of yep yeah, you're right the Birdman so here we go I'm gonna lower it down just a little bit so it gets all on the screen and watch the circumference of the Mona that's gonna fit the circumference here you see watch <laughs> don't shoot the messenger it's Leo's pulling while he's building and hiding his tricks and what's 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 really really cool about them okay is is that if you take a look you can see right here there's the big owl see see the big owl what's on her cheek that's the big old spot that he hides okay and so don't forget he makes it move so there's gonna be a bigger spot hiding in here so when you pull this back down and you look at this owl and you go back into what we were playing. Okay. You'll see how the owl is here. Watch. You, you see this owl? Watch. Now I'm going to hold it where, at dead center in between the ears. And you can actually see the cut line going. And there's a point here and there's a point there. So when you... <laughs> When you overlay the points, you get the face. I know it sounds kind of real difficult because, you know, it took me 10 weeks, 10 hours a day, and I almost gave up before I said, Ah, look at this. Look at this tomato that got to throw against the wall. My goodness, it's an M. <laughs> That's how difficult it is. So maybe I'm way above trying to explain it to you. But some of you have really caught on and understood where it is but you could see this guy right here see this guy he's got an eye and an eye and a nose and a little mouth he's kind of like a human dog and he's going in here he fits he fits but he blurs it like a cloud so i'll hold this and i'll draw in on that for you right there which is his face and there's the human dog and we're going to go one more time up Boom! That's where he hides his human dog. <laughs> or somewhat. So listen, I know this is a vague YouTube, but I have nearly a thousand YouTubes. I thought I had well over a thousand. But I guess it's um, they don't calculate my other YouTubes under different other names. I'm not sure how that works. I'm just a guy who's showing you the facts. And these are the facts and I'm hoping you agree and I'm hoping you keep continuing because I'm going to come up with what you're looking for that you're really actually going to see and with that I want you guys to do me a favor there's a YouTube kids down there and it's text the children from bad videos of some individuals that just want to make money and and um, don't care about certain things but some of them have just got to show the facts once in a while there's some things I have to block or censor but with that in mind uh, hit that text it's easy to do it costs nothing to subscribe it's free all you got to do if you really want to help out somebody watch the commercials these people work hard and they get paid if you watch the commercials and not only that they're trying to sell you something good most of them and with that i want to say listen wash your hands social distance 
and wear a mask. And with that, may God bless the whole world, the whole universe, and the whole heavens, and have a safe, safe life. Amen. There goes the bird man. Hmm, Leo liked to fly. Amen. Amen. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I keep finding the good ones. You see the sleeve on my man right dead center? This is the sleeve in this area of my man. Well, we're going to get into this again, the skull. But it is in another type of deal that is near it. So watch this. When I go to blow this up, you can see when I zoom in, you see that duck? Quack quack. <laughs> You're gonna see. You see you see that beak right here? Here it is. Well watch this. I got it preset. So here we go. We're gonna go right back to where we were and I'm gonna show what that's all about because that duck is in my man's sleeve. And so we're gonna zip this back down, gotta keep it all nice and neat, okay? Because I don't wanna get in trouble with anybody. It's kinda of like dusting the computer. Okay, we got that off. Now don't forget to subscribe. Now this so happens to be the diary of Leonardo da Vinci. This is the diary. That is the older Mona Lisa, that is Jesus Christ proposing to the Mona Lisa with a lot of the different women of his stylist within it. Look up stylus. Stylus is an interpretation of many different individuals or different items in which he brought to life. Now this is, when it's changed, this sleeve, okay, turns in to this when you pull the colors. And if you take a look right here, boom, 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 boom. You see that duck head right there? That is the duck head right there. And you can see the body, how it flows. It gets wilder because he's in the ducks, obviously. And then I'm just gonna slide this down. And then when you flip this up and you look here, there's the duck head. Boom, 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 boom. That's in the Mona. Now watch when I lay over the two and you'll see a hundred percent identical. Boom. Hey. Two ducks are better than one. <laughs> and also, you can see when I go to zoom it down, boom, you can see how some of the lines, how he gives you different markings, how they fit. So you pull it on, boom, you go back up, and they fit exactly. So let me get this right here for you. A little slip reach, we're trying to work left. I'm a righty. You can see the curve here. I pull it down, you see how it starts to curve, goes back up, and you pull it down, there's the curve right here. And and if you see this big old white thing, you can see an arrow and stars floating through here. So he gives you these markings, which is cool. Really, really, really cool. So now we got two ducks better than one, right? And we pull this bond back, and don't forget. I've shown you not only the x-ray, the signature, I showed you the ducks, I showed you over a thousand YouTubes, I've showed you to where that um, the, the older Mona and Jesus Christ and 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 uh, Sali and Melzi and his lovers and the name written Melzi, all kinds of things. So listen, this is the older Mona Lisa. It's a diary after he died. The reason why it cannot be beaten after he died, he, his lover passed it on to have his friend sign it in code, rest in peace. It's got so many signatures and so much information of the days that he lived that's hidden in there. It is so beautiful, it's not even funny. Check out my YouTubes and remember, okay, I need you guys to give a thumbs up Hit the notification bell, uh, subscribe, and with that, I would like you guys to wash your hands, social distance, wear a mask, and again, I hope you like the ducks. I did. It was a great, great find, and I hope you think so too. Show it and help a brother, teach a teacher, tell your lover two ducks are better than one, and with that, 
<laughs> May God bless the whole world, the whole universe, and the whole heavens. And you have a wonderful, wonderful time. Amen. Amen. Amen.
love you. Have a great day.